Pop Talk right now, we're going to start with Bond, James Bond. You know, do you remember during the rollout for Spectre, the last movie, Daniel mm -hmm. Craig was being a little cranky here. He was kind of saying, maybe it's time I move on. And you, you think, wow, you're making a lot of money to be James Bond. Well, he's making it all pretty clear now. That's right. So Craig has reportedly turned down a whopping $100 million to return as Bond. Wow. So that would have covered two more films. He would have also received a producing credit. So yeah. I don't know. So he said in previous interviews that he has Bond fatigue, and apparently not even this hefty salary and this whole pay package will bring him back. There are rumors flying about all kinds of different actors who could become the next Bond. The one that seems to be at the forefront is an actor named Tom Hiddleston. Uh, who could be taking his place. All of them seem to be Brits, you know, mm -hmm. because you have to, or there have been some with a bit of an Irish brogue who have been able to bit. put on the Bond thing. Right. So we'll yeah, see. I'm, I'm shocked he's turning down that money, to yeah. be honest with you. But one of the coaches from The Voice, though, is dropping a new album today. Yeah, Blake Shelton says the new, uh, the new work is 100% about, well, the past 18 months of him going through a divorce with Miranda Lambert and finding new love with girlfriend Gwen Stefani. Mm -hmm. So the title of the album is If I'm Honest. All right, well, he does have a track on that record that is a duet with his new love interest and former fellow coach on The Voice. So yeah. did you know that Blake has 21, 21 number one country <laughs> hits? Uh, so you know, if you're maybe. not into country, you may say, well, I don't know anything about Blake, right. but it, it, this guy is huge. Yeah, so I mean, yeah. maybe now life is imitating art. I don't know. Very interesting, we'll yeah. See. So, you know, when a child tells you a joke, it can be more cute than funny. Mm -hmm. Knock, knock. Uh, but then Seth Rogen and Jimmy <laughs> Fallon got involved to deliver the same kind of kid jokes. They get a little more funny than cute. I'm being a character for this guy. <laughs> you guys hear about the two antennas that got married? No. It was a nice ceremony, but the reception was amazing. <laughs> I'll leave you guys with this one. <laughs> What did Dr. Frankenstein say about his dog's drool? <laughs> it's saliva. <laughs> Thank you all. That's it for me. Seth Rogen, Hi, yo. <laughs> Seth Rogen was um, on promoting his new movie, which comes out today. I thought that they were hilarious. If you get a chance to watch all yeah. of these kid jokes, they were, they were pretty impressive.